why do we have to wait? In human design, over 90% of the aura types are wait for an invitation or wait to respond with the sacral or wait 28 days. Why do we have to wait? If you know your human design strategy, you've probably had those exact thoughts. If you don't know what human design is or you want to learn about it, visit ReikiMarco.com. You can generate a body graph totally for free. So why is it that we have to wait? Well, unlike a lot of other new age kind of trends, instead of making human beings OP, overpowered, and just like, you are the creator of the universe and you have so much power, human design kind of cuts us off at the knees. But it does it in a way that actually grounds us into our bodies. See, new age spirituality, a lot of that is about transcending the body. Whereas human design is actually about getting into the form, into the body. The reason you have to wait is because although your spirit and mind are infinite, your body is not. Your body graph is a representation of the physical circuitry that you have. Meaning that even if your mind is a Formula One race car driver, if your vehicle is a motorcycle or a wagon, they, you can't drive it like a Formula One car. You have to drive the vehicle like the vehicle that it is. Now, most of us are here to be in a state of co-creation. We're not just supposed to be here soloing life, okay? We're here to be in co-creation. This is also where so much power comes from, collaboration. There's an old saying that goes, if you want to go fast, go alone. If you want to go far, go together. And waiting for an invitation 28 days or for a response is the way that us generators, manifesting generators, projectors, and reflectors maximize that co-creation potential. The reality is you can co-create with anybody you want, but it's not going to be the best for you. Why? Because you went against yourself. Instead of using your aura to bring the things that are supposed to be in your life to you, you went out questing, you went out trying to prove yourself, you went out trying to solve other people's problems so that you can get some level of validation. In other words, you're comparing yourself to something external rather than actually experimenting with what's going on in, in the internal world. What does all of this inside of me actually want? One of the best things that you can do while you're waiting is to literally just create art. And I don't mean like record a song to put out or make a painting to sell or like creating a choreography for a show. I mean like just painting for the sake of painting or just making music for the sake of music. There are so many different skills that are refined just through the conscious and unconscious practice of making art. You could even make art about how annoyed you are about having to wait. Because here's the truth. You just need to be more patient, okay? If you plant a tree in the ground and you get impatient because it's not growing fast enough, so you dig up the tree to see if it's actually still growing, you end the life of the tree. And that's what 90% of people run into when they go out and try to initiate things instead of waiting for an invitation, waiting 28 days, or waiting for something to respond to. And if you think you're doing a good job of waiting, I want to invite you to check yourself on that. And this is not about me being right. This is about you living the life that you actually deserve. And if you do not learn how to wait, you do not cultivate patience. Unfortunately, you do not deserve to live your dream life. Let me know in the comments if this tickled something.